Hello everyone. My name is Harshit Bhutra and you're watching Digital Sun City. On this channel, I make videos related to WordPress and digital marketing. So, if you want to learn more of WordPress and digital marketing, then you can press the subscribe button below. That way, you'll be notified as soon as I publish a new video. So now, let's get started with this video. In this video, you will learn how to customize the multiple choice fields in WP forms. Before starting, Make sure that you have successfully installed and activated WP Forms. If not yet, then you can visit my affiliate link to get started with WP Forms. Now, simply move on to WP Forms and click on All Forms or you can also create a new form by clicking on Add New. Let me enter a name for this form. I will select a blank template as of now. You will get a multiple choice field under Standard Fields. Simply Drag and drop the multiple choice field like this to the preview section. To configure its settings, hover onto the multiple choice field and click on it. Now here you can edit the label of this field. Remove the choices one by one like this. In case you want to add the choices, then simply click on this button over here. Enter the name of the choice here. You can also add the choices in bulk by clicking on this bulk add button over here. Add the choices here, one per line. Once done, simply click on add choices. The multiple choice field also enables you to add images to your choices. Simply enable this option and now you can add a separate image to all the choices like this. I have already uploaded the images to my media library. So I will simply select the images one by one. Once done, simply click on save. Now let's preview this form to check the changes. You can see the multiple choice field in action and images have been added here like this. You can select the choices by simply clicking on them. Now let me tell you one more interesting thing about using dynamic choices. WP forms enables you to pull data such as post titles from your WordPress site to use as choices in your selected fields. After you update this information elsewhere on your site, it will update in your forms too. So to do that, simply click on the advanced tab of the multiple choice field and here you can see an option of dynamic choices. Simply select the post type from the list and now all the post titles will be added as the choices under the multiple choice field. Don't forget to save the changes. Let's view the choices in the front end. You can see here, post titles have been added as the choices under the multiple choice field. So this is how you can customize the multiple choice fields in WP forms. I hope you like this video. It takes me a lot of efforts to create free videos like these for all of you people. So please consider to subscribe. And if you have any questions or suggestions, then you can directly go to our website digitalsuncity.com slash help and then fill in the contact form with your questions. I'll reply to that as soon as possible. Thank you for watching this video. Hey, before you quit, I have an amazing offer for you. I am giving away free access to all of my digital resources to all of my viewers. These digital resources can be divided in two types. The first thing is layouts. This includes hundreds of templates for Divi, Elementor, Visual Composer and a lot of royalty free graphics which you can use on any website. Now the second thing is premium WordPress video tutorials. In the coming weeks, I am creating video courses for all the major WordPress themes and plugins. This will include video tutorials for WordPress, Divi, Astra, Elementor, Visual Composer and lot more. So as you can see, I have already started working on them. Now to get all of these premium digital resources, you have to go to my website digitalsuncity.com slash VIP and put in your email address. And then you will receive an email which will contain all of these things. That's it. So go to the link in the description right now and claim all of these resources instantly. I am waiting for you to get my digital resources for free.